Good morning and welcome to Monday's edition of Making It Work. I'm hoping that um, I don't mess this one up. I've lost the last two weeks of this show. So, anyway, I um, filmed yesterday three videos actually and that's very unusual for me. So, um, I'm hoping I can do something every week besides this. I haven't done a get ready with me for a long time, but I just have not felt like wearing that much makeup. It's just really hard for me right now. Um, going, like, I, like I told you the last few weeks that I lost, I'm going through a kind of a rough patch right now. And just trying to pull myself out of it. Uh... Just a lot of feelings, a lot of sadness, but you know, I'll I'll get out of it. I will get out of it. People have it a lot worse than me. So anyway, let's get into my makeup of the today. Today, um, I am wearing my new Koki. You're gonna see this in a haul later on in the week. Um, Koki Cosmetics Brow Mascara in Light Brown. Cute packaging. Really cute packaging. Um, first impressions. Really wet. I am hoping this isn't going to be another uh, Kardashian beauty that smears everywhere. Because this, this smeared pretty good. Um, and look how dark it is. <laughs> I mean, it's not that it's that dark. It's that it really puts the product on. So you have to use a very light hand, which I did not to begin with. And this eye always looks so much worse than this one because, or this brow, because I was in an accident and this one's got lots of scars. So it's really hard to get them to look the same for me. This one here I like, this one I don't. <laughs> And so, for my lashes today, I wore Benefit Roller Lash. Got a sample. Still going very strong. I really like this mascara. Does very good things for my lashes. Blush. Wearing the Mineral Blush by Santee. And I do Color 02 is all it says. Cute packaging, cute pr pretty blush, you can see it this way because it's a flower, very powdery, but it's a dollar. I mean, it's um, a Shop Miss A blush, so it's only a dollar, but it's, it's still a nice pretty color, so just have to tap your blush, brush off. Okay, for lipstick today, I wore my nude um, lip liner from Ulta. And I wore ColourPop's Lippy Stick in Beautycon. This is a Beautycon plus ColourPop collab. It was the um, from one of the first Beautycon boxes. And it is the exact same color as my nude lip liner exactly but it's very pretty I really I do like the color a um, little bit brown but it's not brown enough that I'm not a fan so it's very wearable so anyway um, no therapy today uh, one of our ladies the one that I, I talked to you about about before that um, I didn't get along with last year that you know we're fine this year we haven't had any run-ins at all so far she left today flying to Scotland um, her daughter is daughter lives there and she's already married they got married before they flew to Scotland in the States but now they're gonna get married in Scotland I have the big wedding so she flew there. So she'll be gone for three weeks. So it's going to be very nice and quiet because she is very loud and outspoken. She's a New York, New Yorker. <laughs> That's how she talks. And 
<laughs> I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye bye. Good morning and welcome to Tuesday's edition of Making It Work. Um, I have physical therapy today, so I'll let you know tomorrow morning how that went. I still actually feel a little bruised. <laughs> I, when I touch it, I can feel my muscles still hurt, but it's not physically, like if I sit down in my chair, I can't feel it anymore. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Let's go over what I wore today in makeup. I wore my Ulta, my favorite of all time, my Ulta Brow Tint in Light. And it's got the ter the tiny little spoolie, which I absolutely love. Um, let's talk a little bit about yesterday's brow. I wore the Koki Cosmetics Brow Mascara um, in Light Brown. It is very, very wet. Um, just like the Kardashian Beauty is very wet uh, and smears. And I don't look in the mirror very much at work. I'm a dishwasher. I don't have time. Um, if I go to the bathroom, I'm running to the bathroom and wash my hands and running back out. Maybe glance at myself in the mirror. Um, I usually look at myself at the end of the day the last time I go to the bathroom. Which sometimes is the only time I go to the bathroom. You know, it depends. Of course. <laughs> um, and my brows were a nightmare. They were patchy and it they looked um, painted on. Um, they looked terrible. I'm thinking about returning this because it sucks really bad. Um, I, I'm not happy with it whatsoever. So, I don't know yet. I'm going to have to think about it. But I'm thinking of returning it. They, they looked absolutely horrid by the end of the day. I uh, have my heat running. I turned my heat on for the first time last night because I was sitting here cold. I mean, it was 50 degrees in here, so I was cold. And um, this morning, I'm really congested. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping it was just the, the initial dust wafting, you know, in the air or something. I don't know. Um, but I'm really congested, uh, sinusy, having to blow my nose a lot this morning. Allergy type congested. Anyway, let's keep going. I wore my new favorite, my Lights Camera Lashes by Tarte. I'm absolutely loving this. Um, I got this the last 21 Days of Beauty. And I am so glad I did. It, I think it makes my lashes look really good. I don't know if you can tell or not. I mean, I don't have a ton of lashes. So, but I'm really happy with it. Um, blush. I wore my Urban Decay. Decay? <laughs> Decay. Um, Afterglow blush in fetish. The packaging. I, I could just die. I love this packaging. And then it's even it's got the very cool mesh up here. And then here's the blush. Isn't that pretty? I absolutely love it. I don't know if you can tell much or not. Uh I wore my Ulta um nude lip liner. I'm going to have to get some more lip liners here pretty soon. I'm hoping they maybe have a special on these again this, this Christmas so I can get another set of them. If not, I will just be getting these two because these two match the most of what I wear to work. You know, I've got other ones that are darker for 
get ready with me is stuff like that but these two here I wear exclusively although I just, did just order a couple um, and then today I'm wearing the Kate lipstick by Rimmel and this is number 17 I hate that they don't have names just a very pretty nude I really like um, Kate lipsticks I wear them quite often. Um, yesterday was a bad day. Um, as you know, I am going through kind of a, a rough spot. So I'm. it's even worse that I am in such pain every day. I mean, I'm a 10 out of 10 by the time I get, or by noon. I'm 10 out of 10, and I, then I suffer all afternoon until I can get home and get in my chair and get in that heat, uh, get that heating pad on. It's awful. Um, I, I don't know how I'm supposed to live like this. I honestly don't. I mean, please, don't get me wrong, because I would never hurt myself. Never. That is against my beliefs. I would never do something like that. So it's just uh, something's got to change. This physical therapy has either got to work wonders or else they've got to get me on disability where I cannot work because of my back. It, that's all there is to it. Um, I've either got to be on disability where I cannot work or because this is just a, a hard job. If any of you have ever done anything close to being a dishwasher, uh, you know, I'm not working in a busy restaurant where we have a thousand customers for lunch, but we have 300 and some students every lunch where I'm the only person that's washing all those dishes and a lot of those kids use two to three dishes and two to three glasses. I mean, glasses are easy, but, um, and all the pots and pans and all the uh, baking stuff and all, it all falls on me. It's everybody that works there against me. I have got one helper from um, 11 to two that um, is Down syndrome. So, you know, he does, he does help me, though. I mean, I don't know what I'd do without him. And then I have a helper meh, from 2 to 3.30 when I'm off, which he's out there working at the, the outside of our dishroom sink where everybody dumps their stuff. So he is scrubbing stuff and getting it ready to go through the dishwasher, where um, he's scrubbing stuff. Well, nobody scrubs stuff for me. I have to do my own scrubbing. So it's it's a hard job. It is a... Uh, I'm twisting and turning and bending and lifting and all that stuff. So I'm in pain all day. I took... Yesterday was the first day that I took... Um, two of my acetaminophen when I got there yesterday morning. It says take two and they're eight hour long lasting. I'm taking three today. I know you're not supposed to, but I'm gonna. Um, I took two yesterday morning and then at my break then I took my vitamin and I took my first pain pill. My um, Mobic it's called. Herbal Oxicam is the, the um, generic. It's an anti-inflammatory pain pill. Never even touched my pain. Neither one of those touched my pain. So, um, I'm going to take three acetaminophen this morning. See if that helps a little bit more. Because I can't live like this. I just can't. It hurts too bad. You know, when I'm at home... Um, it's tolerable. It's still probably, it's never probably less than a five pain level. Never, ever less than a five. But it's between a five 
and a 10 at home, depending on what I'm doing. So, anyway, I've wasted enough of your time this morning, and I will talk to you tomorrow morning, let you know how my physical therapy went today. Good morning, Bye. and welcome to Wednesday's edition of Making It Work. I'm tired this morning. <laughs> I, I didn't want to get going too bad this morning. I had a heck of a time going to sleep. I am so tired when I go to bed. And I'm about falling asleep in my chair. But when the lights go out, computer goes off, my mind goes on. And I don't want to sleep. Crazy. So I read for a little bit. And that usually helps. Um, I don't think it was long after I put my book away that that uh, I went to sleep. So has anybody watched any of the new shows yet? Um, last night I watched, um, I know I'm a day late because I don't have cable TV, so I have to get my um, my TV shows another way. So I watched last night from Monday's, from Monday night I watched um, Young Sheldon, which is very cute. Very cute. If you watch, have ever watched The Big Bang Theory, um, which I have not for years, so I want to start from the beginning and watch that series. But um, Young Sheldon is very cute so far. I watched The Good Doctor, which I highly recommend. I like it. And I watched The Brave, and I really liked it too. Um, so tonight, I'll watch whatever debuted last night. Uh, that I, I'm interested in. There's there's a few things that I'm interested in. Not a ton of stuff, but a few things. Also, um, Scorpion started Monday night, which I haven't watched yet, but I absolutely love that show. I had uh, physical therapy last night, and it went really well. We started off 15 minutes, always, as usual, with the... Um, uh, TENS unit or electrodes on my back, you know, pulsing energy into my back. Uh, that went really well with the heat pad also. Then we did some stretching. Um, she stretches my legs. She's trying to get the my hamstrings and the uh, muscles on the front of my uh, calves loosened up because they are so tight. And then we went in to, and um, I used this bicycle where my hands are going like this and my feet are going like this. And I went for five minutes on that. And then we went to the steps and she wants me to loosen up those, the front of my calves. So I would put one foot just a little bit on the step and the other foot on the step and just kind of lean back and... She wants me to do that for 30 seconds every day. That'll be easy for me because I have a couple steps in my house. I have a couple steps coming up to my house. So that'll be really an easy exercise for me. Um, let's talk about my makeup today. First thing I used was um, the e.l.f. brow. And that's what it looks like. Um... I'm starting to be a little concerned about my brows at work because I sweat and at the end of the day like I was that Koki Cosmetics I don't know if I'm gonna wear that one again that one was bad today um, I'm gonna see how my brows look at the end of today and see because I may just quit wearing brow stuff to work and I know I hardly have any brows to look at but that, that was a scary thing. <laughs> For my mascara today, I used the Lash Domination by Bare Minerals. And I have had this one, I am not kidding, for probably three, four years. And it's still going strong. It it won't be long and it's, it's starting to, to get a little drier. But it still does good things for my lashes. I really like it. So I'm going to hang on to it for a bit longer. Um, probably won't keep it for a whole lot longer, but I'm going to, for a while. Uh, for 
my cheeks today, I wore City Color Rosy Cheeks. Very pretty. Very pretty. Uh, very powdery. But it's very pretty. I like it. You know, and it's not an expensive brand, so you, I expect it to be powdery. Use my Nude Ulta Lip Liner. And then today I used my new... Um, Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink. I would. I had really high hopes for this because I've seen some good um, reviews on this on YouTube. I've also seen a couple that they didn't like it as well. So uh, it's so hard nowadays to believe to know what to believe on YouTube because people are getting all this PR and stuff, and they're giving such good reviews. You don't know if they're telling the truth because they're get they keep want they want to keep getting this PR, right? Anyway, um, very pretty, sticky. I'm still sticking together. I thought it went on kind of patchy, um, kind of streaky. But one one application is all I needed for sure. Uh, it was, I went out of the lines a little bit. It was easy to clean up. See, it's got that little pocket there. Um, it's very pretty, and I will continue to use it, but it is, as of right now, I've, you know, put it on right before I turned on the camera, and it is still sticky. Very pretty color, though. Very pretty. I really like this nude. It's not too light. It's, it's a very pretty nude. Okay, that's it for my day. To, uh, we're having, our chef is coming today from um, Vegas, I believe, an executive chef. We have some huge catering events the next three days. So um, today I get off at my regular time because I have PT, so I had to. But the next two days I will probably work a little longer. I don't know. I... I guess I'll wait and see what she tells me to do. So it could be a little tense in the kitchen the next couple of days because he does not tolerate goofing around. He does not tolerate um, a whole lot of talking in the kitchen. I've heard. I don't know what makes them so arrogant and so... Um, you do what I say or else, you know, kind of thing. He, I mean, he's not my boss. <laughs> but I don't want to piss him off either. <laughs> because he's an important part of these caterings and stuff. Yeah, I I wanted to show you too. Um, I've got three fingers. I don't know if you can see that or not. That are kind of sliced up a little bit. I picked up a tomato slicer yesterday that it's a big machine and I didn't expect I didn't even know it was happening until I put it down and I had blood on my fingers so I had to rewash it of course a couple times but um, they're just sliced up I, it'll be interesting to see how it goes today if they if I have to put band-aids and a glove on because they sting or what anyway I'll see you tomorrow Bye. Good morning, and welcome to Friday morning. Wait, what happened to Thursday? <laughs> well, I had my makeup on, all ready to go yesterday morning. Hit that little button on my camera, and it tells me my memory card is full. So last night, I didn't have time to mess with it yesterday morning. So last night I came home and... and uh, I finally figured out to take my memory card out of here, and I do have a slot in my laptop. I did not know that in all these years that I've had that laptop. <laughs> so it's going to make it so much easier. I don't have to lug my laptop in here and, and plug it in and download it. I can just take my memory card and do it that way. So anyway, uh, Wednesday... I must have hit the button twice or something because it kept recording. 
So I kind of watched in fast motion and you could tell when it was getting lighter out. <laughs> oh, something, something always with me, isn't it? Always. So first off, I want you, I would love for you guys to keep Lulu and her family still in your, in her prayers. I know this is going to air on Sunday and this will all be over with by then, but, um, Today is his visita is Vito's visitation. Tomorrow is his funeral. So the next few days are going to be very hard on her and her kids. I mean, not that the rest of the time isn't going to be hard. But it's always hard when you have strangers coming up to you or, or people, you know, just coming up to you and hugging you. That I don't want to be touched when I'm grieving because I cry too easy. So... Anyway, anyway, yesterday's makeup, I am just going to switch to next week. I'm not even going to show you what I wore. I, I'll just wear it next week. All right, today, for my favorites of the week, which would be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, uh, first off, a surprise, surprise, over my Ulta gel is the e.l.f. pencil. I, I kind of like this that it's it's easy to, to apply. Um, I'm getting better at it. Still, you know, trying. I have a lot of difference between my brows. You know, this one here has got a lot of scars in it from when I was young going through a windshield. And this one here is fine and... I can't get them to match no matter what I do. So, anyway, um, this helps me a little bit more with that. For my lashes, no surprise here. It's Lights Cl Camera Lashes by Tarte. I love the long wand on it to begin with. I, I really appreciate the long wands. And I love the way it makes my lashes look. Okay, next is my blush, and it is my Urban Decay Fetish Blush. I really do lo love this color. If you could tell. Lipstick. I Today, the only thing different with this lipstick is I, I started wearing my pink nude. Well, it broke on me. I, I only had like a millimeter left anyway of it. But it's gone now. So, in the trash it goes. I guess I'll take a picture of it first. And the lipstick I chose is the Maybelline um, Superstay Matte Ink. And I, I kept it in my favorite today. Is because when I got off work on Wednesday when I wore this, it was still on. It had, you know, the inside of my lip, <coughs> excuse me, the inside of my lip was gone, you know, but the rest of it was still there after I had eaten twice because I had breakfast in the morning and then I had some lunch. I didn't have a lot of lunch that day, but I had some lunch and it was still on my lips. So that is why I chose this. Now, Right now, it's very sticky, and that I do not like. Um, and I rubbed my lips together at first when it was wet. Um, is fine, but as it just started drying down, it takes some of the... So make sure you don't rub your lips together um, too much. So anyway, that is that. So that is my makeup of the week, and yesterday was a nightmare at work. Absolute nightmare. As It's homecoming week. So Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, um, we have an executive chef here. Today is the last day. Um, he, I thought the chef one was coming from Vegas, but actually he came from Rapid City, South Dakota. He's still an executive chef. He's he's very good at what he does. He's very personable. He's a nice guy. Um, but he is here making all the meals 
for the caterings that we're doing. The president of the university has a big um, deal at her home where they cater it with uh, all of the board members and that kind of stuff. And and the boards of trustees are, are here um, in, in the school having a big meeting and then they have fancy meals. I mean, they're very fancy. Fancy plates, fancy. So I have double, I still have all my students to do to wash their dishes, plus I have all this catering stuff to do. And they actually had me bombarded in my um, dish room. I don't know, it was a, a hazard because I couldn't get out of there. If, if I had to get out of there fast, if there was a fire or something, I would have had to crawl over stuff. Um, I was really upset over that. Really upset because it is a hazard. It It's a tripping hazard to begin with. It's, yeah. But they had no place to go with their dishes. They had I had so many dishes. I stayed until 5 o'clock last night. I worked from 7 until 5 yesterday um, to catch everybody up. So it took me an hour and a half after my normal time to get off to catch up yesterday. And I'm going to do the same thing today. But today is the end of it. So it'll, it'll be back to normal on Monday, thank goodness. So anyway, I hope you guys have a great weekend. And uh, hopefully my hair is going to look different on Monday if I get my butt out of the chair long enough tomorrow to do it. <laughs> <laughs> I will talk to you very soon. Love you guys. Bye.